Hi, Cappy. Welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well. This is going to be for anybody with Capricorn placements in their charts. Make sure you all flip and you switch the roles. Take what resonates. Leave it doesn't fit for your situation, guys. Thank y'all so much for your love, your support, your donations, and your super chat. Super thanks. The love never goes unnoticed. I'm returning that back to y'all tenfold. Okay, anything you guys need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box. And please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms, okay? So let's see, Cappy. Let's see what's going on here. My nose itch. All right, spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses, please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Cappy and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones returning back to the sender. Block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Capricorns. And protect me as I channel the messages for Cappies. So let's see. What's going on for my Capricorns here? Give me one card for Cappy. Give me one theme card. Give me one theme card here for Capricorn. Oh, that's all something fly. Okay, so we have Ascension. It's a upgrade, activation, progress, timelines, and shifting. Bloom here. Radiance, goddess, beauty, attract, nectar, and glow. Period. So you're going through a massive upgrade right now, an Ascension um, Capricorn. Okay. You're going through a massive Ascension here. Or you have upgraded. You have ascended. Okay. Damn, I really, I, I really feel like you've ascended like to the highest. Yeah, look, the Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> That's like, I feel like you're getting ready to receive your inheritance now because you, you've ascended. There's something here where you're getting ready to receive. You're getting ready to be in heaven on earth, basically. There's, I feel like you're serving a purpose now. Or you've been serving a purpose. Obviously, you had to step into your purpose and um or stay focused on your purpose but i feel like now you're getting ready to serve you're getting ready to do something that's really really big here like it's getting ready to be the biggest part of your journey yet so let's just see though what's this ascension here for cappies what's this what is this for capricorn I feel like you're getting close to source, like God, source, whatever, you know, the universe, whatever you want to subscribe to, really. Yeah, look, the judgment, that's, yeah. <laughs> so you're going through a massive rebirth here, or you're rising, you're the phoenix rising from the ashes here, for sure. Definitely, you're getting ready to serve a purpose, though, or you're in your purpose, you're in your calling, you're on your north node, like, this is this is a purpose here or you're this could also be you being tested or whatever but i feel like you passed some sort of test this could be you passing some sort of test you could also be like um you forgiving your past here and you're ready to move forward to your next phase what else going through a major awakening yeah the queen of swords <clears throat> So your purpose could be for you to be speaking or your voice your voice needs to be heard here yeah, you're very experienced. You're on the card to say experience. So you've been through a lot here. I feel like you're very wise. You're very discerning. You could be going through something here where you're needing to communicate. You're, you're needing to set boundaries. Speak your truth or raise your standards. Okay, five of pentacles reverse. Nice. So... Some of you guys, your health is improving, okay? Your um, your finances could be improving. Somebody here could be getting a new job or um, you released and let go of a connection. You learned your lesson from it and you're done dealing with it. Okay, what else? <laughs> you're coming out of some sort of financial lack or worry or whatever you was worried about. The Knight of Cups in the reverse. Mm. So this is somebody that's in genuine Knight of Cups reverse could be somebody that's a troublemaker or very emotionally immature. Um, someone that's obsessed with you. Somebody's obsessed. And they're they're a troublemaker. And they're really um sexual. Like this person runs around and have a lot of one-night stands here. I feel like you're being vindicated. 
okay you're being vindicated here somebody could have been saying that you was like this or you was this and that and you're not um king of cups came out scorpio so this king of cups here could be somebody that's in love with you they care about you um maybe this person could be being tested too because the knight of cups reverse could talk about like somebody not being confrontational okay or not really speaking their truth or saying what the fuck they need to say um this could also be too this masculine being tested to, to see where they going are they going to follow their heart or are they going to run around like something like that but I feel like there, there's a true love here for some of you, Cappy, and it, it is blocking out this obsessive creep. Whoever the fuck this is, this Knight of Cups in the reverse. I don't like that ass. What else? I feel like you're making a solid decision about this queen, this King of Cups, and you're standing on that. It's like, I feel like you forgive this person, this Knight of Cups in the reverse person, but they don't. that's not good enough for them. So with that being said, they're going to start trouble or they're just going to be an obsessed creep. And I feel like you're going to call judgment on their ass because you're over it. What else? Like, leave me the fuck alone. Yeah, the nine of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody here is codependent. They greedy as fuck. Codependent. They're a scam artist, a con artist. Okay. This could be the person that you're releasing, letting go of. Somebody here is either a man or, or a woman whore. Like, they just, I don't know what their problem is. But this person here wants to marry somebody for money or whatever. Yeah, somebody is like, somebody's awakening to the fact that somebody is sleeping around a lot. Whoever this is has a lot of one night stands. Nine of Pentacles reverse is a prostitute. Okay. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse is that. I feel like there's a man here that's being tested to see how they're going to handle the situation with this nine of pentacles reverse i feel like somebody making a decision yeah to reject their ass let their ass go and okay what's the judgment yeah the hierophant yeah somebody stepping into their purpose as a hierophant that's exactly what somebody doing or somebody standing on straight business this is about principles morals like do your morals and principles and values align with somebody like and i feel like somebody is saying that they don't you could be dealing with a Taurus. <clears throat> yeah, like somebody is learning some sort of lesson here. Yeah, the Tower, the Empress. Yeah, somebody learning some sort of lesson. What's uh, the judgment with the Hierophant? Yeah, the Fool in the reverse. Yeah, so somebody is... um. Something could be going on in court for somebody or this spiritual law. <laughs> but the fool in reverse is like somebody behaving childishly or foolish or somebody is making like stupid, reckless decisions. OK, I feel like spirit is watching to see if somebody going to be easily distracted because the fool in reverse is a distraction. OK, what's the fool reverse? Aquarius here. Yeah, the king of wands and the damn reverse. Somebody's a loser. It's <laughs> the king of wands reverse. <laughs> or somebody is remembering um, how they were when they were entertaining the distraction. Okay. You know, codependent, somebody that's like lazy or lacking inspiration, drained of their energy, broke. Like somebody's remembering shit from the past. You know? But I'm getting, though, whoever, this, this King of Wands right here is a warlock, okay? King of Wands reverse is a warlock. They make stupid, reckless decisions. Now their ass is stuck. Five of, cup, five, of, five of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords, they broke and they fucked up here. That's what's going on here. This King of Wands in reverse is competing. They're jealous. What's the fool reverse with the king? But they are pussy ass hoe because they're not confronting you. I feel like this person here is running around having sex with every fucking body. And I feel like you're being vindicated because I'm pretty sure this person is pillow talking and some more shit. They're a man whore, and they, they, I, I don't know. What's the full reverse, King of Wands reverse? This person is very reckless, and I feel like you calling their ass out, or you did what you were supposed to do. Yeah, the Ace of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like the emotional tie, even if you're not with this person, they could be miles away, but they're still thinking about you, 
it's playing around in your energy. I feel like that's over with. Okay, Ace of Cups in the reverse. This could actually be a breakup here, or this could be like the emotional tie to this person is over with. You know, I feel like you're understanding that this is unrequited love. They don't really fuck with you. They don't love you. They don't give a fuck. They just want to use you for what you got, and that's it. They're a reckless ass man whore. That's what they are. Ace of Cups reversed. Like, you don't have no love for them at all. I feel like this person is, is, this is a lot of oppressed, oppression here. This person is, um, broken internally. Like, this person will trauma dump on you. Um, they could be doing something to make you carry that weight. Like, make you feel emotionally distorted or, um, really out of sorts, depressed, sad or like this is like a trauma bonding shit trauma bonding relationship it's a distraction okay so what's the hierophant yeah the ten of cups that's definitely for some of you this is a counterpart um but if not i feel like this is a lesson here about how to truly unconditionally love yourself okay like this person here is abusive or they were abused and now they're they're the abuser 11, 11 on the timer. Yeah, confirmation. This person is the abuser that they they turn into the abuser. The abuse turned them into the abuser. Period. But the ten of cups and the, uh, the ten of cups is definitely happiness, joy, inner peace, wholeness, bliss. I feel like some of y'all could be starting a family or getting married. You're going into a new spiritual contract, whatever that may be. But it's going to bring about a lot of bliss and blessings. So, with that being said, <clears throat> they're gonna have to take on their own pain and trauma. They're gonna have to heal that shit like you did. What's the Queen of Swords? Yeah, the world. Some of you guys could be speaking out online. I keep seeing the Queen of Swords and world come out together or came out together a lot in these readings today. But um, the world is you closing out a cycle. And I feel like you are speaking your truth here. You're talking about your experiences with humor, possibly. But you dead serious, though. What's the Queen of Swords with the world? Yeah, the Two of Pentacles. So I feel like you're adapting very well to whatever changes you may be going through here. Um, <clears throat> something is definitely coming into balance for you or I don't know, you could be multitasking, getting a lot of shit done or whatever. But I feel like you're open to these changes. You're letting them in or whatever this is that's balanced out in your energy. What's this two of pentacles? Capricorn, Jupiter or something. Yeah, the ten of wands. Yeah, what's two of pentacles, ten of wands? Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, this transference of energy, okay, is over with. What's two of pentacles, ten of wands? Whatever this person keep on trying to put on you, yeah, this this warfare, this fighting, whatever this is somebody is doing is over with. Just period. Something has been released here, and now something is, is like balanced out for you. It's flowing properly or something like that. This could have something to do with a woman's menstrual cycle or your, your reproductive system too is like balanced out now or something. Okay. Because somebody definitely been playing around in your energy, your sacred energy and all that. But the nine of wands is like you protecting yourself or something here is protected. This is like somebody showing resilience. Yeah, we got the nine to the ten. Sag, moon, Sag, Saturn. So, yeah, there's going to be an ending being put to this. Whatever this is right here, something is really ending. This could be a masculine energy that has healed. Yeah, so something has healed. Yeah, because it's over top of the King of Cups. Somebody has healed here. Their heart chakra is opening. They're being introduced to their gifts or something like that. Mm. What's the world? Yeah, something is balanced. I see that the yin and yang is on this world card. Yeah, the 10% in reverse. The yin and yang here is like, this is balance. Like something is getting ready to be made peaceful or some of y'all getting ready to travel or move. But the temperance reversed is, yeah, the, the cycle is closed out to whoever's antagonizing you, causing an imbalance, discord, disharmony. There's a new beginning. You're not going to have to go through that shit anymore. Just period. And somebody here keep trying to hold on for their life because they don't want to go through the shit that they're getting ready to go through. But I feel like that's your fucking problem, bitch. You got to handle that. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Somebody here want to keep putting all that shit on you. They don't want to let you be happy. It's like, bitch, it's not up to you. You are not God, honey. You are not God. Mm. 
Yeah. So what's this Five of Pentacles reverse? Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Exactly. You're releasing and letting go and doing whatever the fuck you got to do to get this Ten of Pentacles. Because that's that's exactly what you're getting. You guys will be saying 10-10. Ten, ten. You've cleared something off your bloodline, your lineage. I feel like now you're getting ready to fucking build a, um, a legacy, generational wealth here, a family, marriage, all kind of shit come in. A lot of, um, of money, wealth, an empire being built, a business that's going to be very successful. It's going to make y'all a lot of riches. A lot of money. It was five of pentacles reverse, ten of pentacles. Okay, yeah, four of pentacles here, period. Somebody's holding on to you for their life. Like I said, it's for money purposes. It's for money purposes here. They know that you're getting this ten of pentacles. So they they trying to sabotage. They're trying to stop you from getting it because you won't share it with they ass. They're like, well, if I can't have a piece of it, you can't have a piece of it either. This person is crazy <laughs> for even thinking that that's what was going to happen. Could be another Capricorn here, a Virgo, a Leo, a Sagittarius, whatever, Taurus. This is Four of Pentacles. <clears throat> With this Five of Pentacles in reverse, there could be, I, I keep, there's a masculine here that has released a Nine of Pentacles in reverse. I see the Nine of Pentacles to me as a karmic feminine. Okay, somebody has released this person and now they're in, they're getting ready to receive that this inheritance between y'all two. Uh, okay, because somebody was definitely holding on to somebody for money purposes only. What's the Four of Pentacles? Or oh, this your damn, this, I feel like this is your karmic masculine up here for, for you divine feminines. And this is this karmic feminine down here. And they're both weird as fuck. Yeah, the Knight of Swords. What's the Four of Pentacles, Knight of Swords? The Eight of Swords reverse. Yeah, you're coming out of something. And I feel like you're holding yourself back. Yeah, Four of Pentacles is you protecting yourself or you're budgeting, you're saving. And I feel like you're focused on what's to come or you're focused on taking action somewhere. You're doing something. Okay. Eight of Swords in the reverse is you coming out of restriction, coming out of your head. You're not in the self-sabotaging energy anymore. You're being released from some shit, <laughs> whatever this was. Feel like somebody was oppressed for a long time. Hmm. It's like it's like somebody's gonna be penny pinching for a minute, but they getting ready to step into the ten of pentacles. The the only thing that somebody need to be worried about right now is getting rid of this bitch and you getting rid of this stupid nigga. <laughs> like that, that's what I feel like. That that's the focus. It don't matter if you leave him broke or whatever the fuck this is. Somebody is co this is a codependent relationship somewhere, and it's like, yeah, it's just time for it to, to be done with. Like, just period. What's the so I feel like this is a karmic masculine, yeah, the devil. This is a karmic masculine right here. This is a karmic feminine. What's this? What's this Knight of Cups reverse? Wow, the Queen of Cups. Okay, now we got the King of Cups. What's this karmic? What's this Knight of Cups in the reverse? Yeah, exactly. The Queen of Swords. Yeah, I feel like that's you, Divine Feminine, and the Justice, period. Yeah. You didn't set boundaries with this person. You cut them off. You can even have shit in place with the judge, with the courts. It's like you you don't with somebody. They just don't want to see it. They don't want to see it. You know that they're ingenuine. They don't mean well. They don't want you really. They never really gave a fuck about you. They only care about what the fuck they want. They, this person is crazy, and they're obsessive. Which is even scarier. Because motherfuckers, you see what they're doing now. They'll kill your ass in front of any damn body. People have lost their mind. But you're getting ready to receive justice for this. What's the justice here? Yeah, the devil. Yeah, you're getting ready to receive justice for dealing with this devil energy or this obsessed, crazy person. What's the justice with the devil? They're going to have to take accountability <laughs> with the justice upright and the devil. It's like, yeah, you're going to have to take accountability. Like, you ain't got no choice. What's the justice here with the devil? Or, yeah, look at this lying asshole. King of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, something now is balanced out. This is a liar. This King of Swords in the reverse is a liar. They feel like they're going to dictate and control your fucking life. Very mentally and emotionally abusive. Very controlling. The King of Swords reverse with the devil is just like a real demon. <laughs> like this person here is 
they fucked up, okay? Very abusive. Five of Swords, Two of Swords, Four of Cups. Trial. <laughs> now they don't want to confront you. Knight of Cups in the reverse. Like, this person, they're a punk. What's the King of Swords reverse? What they lying about? Definitely, like I said, you're being vindicated because this person, they look stupid. Lying and shit. Definitely Queen of Swords, King of Swords. That's your karmic masculine. Like I said, Divine Feminine. What's King of Swords reverse? Yeah, the tower. Yeah, they ass getting exposed here. Yeah, and somebody is saying that you're innocent. You're the innocent one in the situation. They ass getting exposed and they scared. I feel like they scared. That's what that devil is. Because they know karma coming for their ass. They're going to have to take accountability. They look stupid as fuck. Lame ass. I feel like the tower here is hitting because you're getting ready to get proposed to. You're getting ready to get married. Or um, this is definitely like innocence though. What's the, what's the devil? <laughs> yeah, Will of Fortune. Yeah, they scared of this bad karma that's coming. They scared. Now they, what? Now they want to take accountability or something? I feel like this person just going to go to hell. <laughs> like, I don't see them taking accountability for shit. I really don't. I feel like what's coming out is the fact that you're innocent and you ain't had shit to do with why this person is fucked up in the head, period. Good. Everybody getting they just do. Yeah, somebody scared of being broke, homeless, and poverty. You shouldn't have did what the fuck you did, bitch. You shouldn't have did what you did. What's the King of Cups? Six of Wands here. Yeah, I feel like you're getting ready to win. Exactly. The Queen of Cups. Knight of Cups. You're getting ready to win a real connection. Somebody that really, truly, genuinely loves you. They care about you. Yeah, somebody here like abused you when you were young. You could have met this person when you were young or something like that. Y'all both probably was young, but this person here really abused their power and authority by playing these mind games, causing anxiety, playing on your weaknesses, knowing that you are probably wasn't fully awakened at the time. And now that you are, I feel like, yeah, you calling they stupid ass out. Like, what the fuck? But the Queen of Cups, Knight of Cups, and the Six of Wands, yeah, I feel like you're winning in love. So you're winning real love, real money, real everything. <laughs> like, everything about you is authentic, it's real. Yeah, Three of Pentacles and the High Priestess to the damn Hierophant. Yeah, so this is somebody here that genuinely loves you from their heart space. Like, look how he holding his chest. Like, he made that shit, like, dearly. <laughs> this person here really loves you. And this is what this person don't want. They don't want you to have true love or they don't want you to get this offer. Bitch, it's coming. Yeah, now they sad. Child, we, we don't care. What's the nine of pentacles reverse? Seven of pentacles. Nine of pentacles reverse, seven of pentacles. The Hermit and the Two of Wands. <laughs> so I feel like somebody has ghosted someone. This Hermit with the Two of Wands and the Seven and the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody has ghosted someone, and now they're making an investment somewhere else. Okay. Two of Wands is like somebody waiting or anticipating, but I feel like somebody's just in solitude, planning and strategizing, because this Seven of Pentacles is inheritance. That's what that is. Like, it's wealth, it's um, making smart investments, something that's growing, or somebody here is growing here. Yeah, somebody is growing. They're nurturing themselves. They're growing here. Okay, somebody has just gone ghost to gain some sort of peace and quiet so they can do their shadow work is what I'm getting. Okay, or they're looking then they're they're reading up or looking into some sort of offer that's being given to them. Okay, what yeah, what's the uh seven of pentacles? Three of cups. Yeah, somebody's investing into this fucking reconciliation. What's seven of pentacles, three of cups?
the moon. Yeah, I feel like somebody making their moves in silent. Just period. Cancer Mercury here. We got Cancer Pisces. Oh, I feel like somebody's awakening to the fact that somebody in a friend group is on some fuck shit. Somebody in a friend group is deceptive. Okay, this could be like a secret reconciliation, but I feel like somebody is like reviewing something or evaluating something. They're realizing that somebody in a friend group is working with this nine of pentacles reverse trying to set their ass up or they're just a liar. Somebody's a liar. What's this? What's the hermit? Somebody that they close to. What's the hermit? Yeah. Okay. The Emperor reverse. Six of Cups reverse. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hmm. So this Emperor. This is somebody, this Emperor in Reverse here is just, they just getting on my nerves, bro. This could be somebody's braggedy ass baby daddy. This person just will not let up. Whoever this is trying to abuse their power and position of authority. This person just sit up here and spy, stalk all fucking day. They keep trying to do shit to see who you reconciling with, who you around. Like, why the fuck does it matter? It's not your raggedy ass and will never be you ever again. You punk ass hoe. Keep on hiding behind somebody or trying to do all this stupid ass magic and all this shit. To fucking make somebody do what? Feel scared or somebody trying to project fear onto you to stop you from investing into something else. Or it's like, bitch. So this six of cups in the reverse is, um, oh, mm. something about, a, uh, there's a baby here that's not this masculine. So the emperor in the reverse with the six of cups reverse. There's a baby that's not this masculine. <clears throat> okay, somebody having paternity issues. Because this this nine of pentacles in reverse is... They, they out there. They do whatever the fuck they want to do. And that's cool. But you can do that single. Somebody here using somebody for money. And this person see that. This person is not the father of a child. They're not. Okay. Six of Cups reverse too. I'm getting to the Emperor reverse, Six of Cups reverse. I feel like this person is having an issue with their stability right now because they didn't invest it into a losing hoe. Okay, and it happens. It's just you got to leave it alone to get anywhere now. But I feel like this person is growing up. They're leaving the nest, Six of Cups reverse, but their, their stability is off. So that could be the issue. This person is doing some introspection to figure out their next move and how to become more stable and secure. They're planning right now, strategizing. Okay, <clears throat> yeah, yeah, the page of pentacles and the damn nine of pentacles. That's ten pentacles. The judgment here. This happened like this, so somebody can see that they need to be with the nine of pentacles, page of pentacles. That's ten pentacles in the judgment. That's their purpose, to be with this person, not these hoes. That's your counterpart. That's exactly what somebody realizing. Like, and it, with twins, it happened like that. It really happened that way. You're always going to get guided back to the person you're meant to be with. But anyways, um, or somebody could be doing some sort of introspection and realizing that they were, they were with somebody that's abusive, a narcissist, somebody here just, I'm getting to your karmic masculine, divine feminine is stuck on the past. This person just, they cannot let go of the past. They keep trying to control you by spying, watching, monitoring you and shit like that. What's the two of wands? They keep dealing with these prostitute hoes. I feel like this person is out scouting new people. <laughs> like, this person here think they a pimp, but they losing ass, funky ass hoe. What's the two of wands? <laughs> What's the two of wands? <laughs> Somebody here really be tripping. Yeah, the emperor. Wow, the empress in the reverse. <laughs> so, this is a karmic couple. <laughs> or what? The, what is it? Because, <laughs> oh. What's the two of wands with the Empress reverse? The Eight of Pentacles.
Yeah, somebody is doing something. Somebody has mastered how to deal with this. How to deal with this shit here. The Eight of Pentacles. Somebody's like working on some shit. The Magician. The Page of Pentacles. Yeah, the Five of Swords. Somebody's planning something. Or you're planning something here behind the scenes. What's this in percent in reverse? Somebody could be realizing that this false feminine is it was in a whole relationship the whole time and now they sitting up here pregnant. They was in a commitment the whole time. So they was they, they this child, this false empress made their actual baby daddy the side piece or something like that. Somebody somebody could be sleeping with someone at this person's job or something. What's this empress reverse? And now they're showing up pregnant or whatever. What's the it's a lot going on with that. Yeah, okay, the two of cups. Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. Yeah, the Five of Wands. So somebody's talking about this Nine of Pentacles. They mad as fuck, but they raggedy ass. Somebody here could be making somebody get like an abortion or some shit or term terminate a pregnancy. Somebody could also... Nine of Pentacles in reverse could be a miscarriage here. For some of you, let me see what's the Eight of Pentacles. The Page of Pentacles. For some of you, there's an unexpected pregnancy here that's coming in. Yeah, some of y'all are going to turn up pregnant or... Because somebody is trying to play in your sacred energy to cause a miscarriage too. Somebody here does that kind of shit with a stupid ass. I feel like if they got if they with somebody and somebody end up pregnant, that's the person that's gonna miscarry. It's not gonna be you. But I feel like this is some sort of karmic couple here playing these stupid ass games. I feel like too, there's a narcissist in your energy. The person that they with is realizing who I got this for the other day. <clears throat> Let me see. I think uh, Libra. You could be dealing with a Libra. Yeah, Taurus, Libra here. In percent of reverse. Somebody is realizing that you're going to in a whole new relationship. Like you're committed somewhere. This Emperor in the reverse is a liar. They're lying here. It's like some shit coming out about this person. They're lying about you. To these hoes, to these insecure people. Yeah, confirmation. Yeah, they're lying. Yeah, what give me more on this Empress in the Emperor in the reverse? Yeah, with the with the Ten of Swords, Five of Wands, yeah, they're they're lying here on you to cause a lot of um fights and arguing and shit like that. Uh, to cause someone to be insecure or to make someone feel like they're in competition with you or you're in competition with them, and that's not true. That's what narcissists do though. This stupid bitch right here. What's the damn Emperor Reverse? And, they, and somebody is realizing this empress is realizing that you're in a whole relationship is like you're not even thinking about this bitch here this emperor in reverse is a fucking liar with a warlock ass somebody is sitting up here doing this black magic what's the emperor reverse yeah the knight of pentacles could be a virgo airy strong virgo what's the emperor reverse knight of pentacles nine of cups yeah a greedy asshole a greedy ass bitch here. I feel like somebody here realizing too that they trapped their ass. This man here trapped this woman with a baby. And this was planned. I feel like this was planned on his part. She ain't no shit about it. But that's how they that's how they move though. They keep doing that. They got families all over the fucking place. And they lie to all to everybody. They 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 they're a narcissist. This person is crazy. Yeah, somebody here now could be experiencing miscarriages. I know I did when I was with my narcissist, my ex. Okay, she going through the same thing. The empress in reverse is infertility issues. This person, I feel like right. I feel like I'm picking up on this third party. This this emperor in the reverse is a person that they with right now. They're in a false twin flame connection, but this person is getting offers. Um, 
they could be working or like trying to work on something, trying to build a life or like they're working on their finances and shit like that. And I feel like they're, they keep getting hit with a dead end or something. It's because this person planning this, this person's sacral energy, nine of cups here, nine of cups. Now they could be working with this empress too, to this empress in the reverse to, um, stop a manifestation from coming in. But I feel like this is what they normally do though. So, this is ridiculous. They're waiting on something. And they're not going to get it. They're not going to get anything. It's a scam to go through or something. It's, it has something to do with babies, a, a, a pregnancy. And this is a mess. Or somebody waiting on someone to commit to their ass and they too busy being pressed about your ass. Should I let me see something? I want to see something real quick and then I'm going to go. Oh, this Empress too in the reverse could be watching what you're doing for work. They watching something. Eight of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. They're saying that this person is a liar. What's uh? Mm. Oh, it's a sexually transmitted disease, and someone needs to take care of their health. That's what I landed on. Yeah, cause this this masculine here is running around sleeping with hoes, and they this person is lying. They could be lying and saying that you gave them something, and that's not true. You ain't even dealing with their ass. They could be trying to throw you up in this karmic feminine's face saying, oh, I'm still sleeping with my ex. I know you mad. Ha, ha, ha. You ain't even dealing with this stupid bitch. Yeah, you ain't dealing with this dumb asshole. Lying ass nigga. Weird ass. Stupid ass. What's uh? Somebody like investigating something. What's this, um, what's this, what's this Empress in the reverse doing? Lustful vampires, yes, yeah, sexual drainage. The X, yeah. Mm, what else? What what else here? Yeah, this this person see the man with all these women around him, like that. That's what this person is doing here. Like I feel like she realizing something. Or let me see, what's the Empress Reverse doing? Emancipated. I feel like this is what this masculine is trying to do to you. They could be using third parties here to man, like they doing something to manifest off of your. Say, like they're doing something to your sacral here. But we have emancipated liberation from all restrictions. So yeah, you're, the restriction here is lifted for you. Or this person is trying to free themselves from this damn emperor in the reverse. Yeah, sex addiction. Okay, yeah, I told you something about sex and blah, blah, blah. Materialistic. I feel like this person... <laughs> I'm getting a lot with their ass. This person here sits and plans this shit out. They deal with empresses in the reverse. They get into a relationship with them and, and things progress. And then they start acting like a fucking dick. This person is very sexual too. I feel like they they slowly but surely plan how to like seduce and um play on women's sacral to obtain shit. This person, yeah. This 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 your raggedy ass ex that's on that fuck shit with they lame ass yeah stripped and cleansed you are being purified by spirit give me like two more i feel like that page of pentacles to the eight of pentacles is nine of pentacles that's also pregnancy birth 
So you could be getting ready to get pregnant soon. Somebody's trying to control this here. Not, the Knight of Pentacles with the Nine of Cups. This could be somebody here um, coming to finish what they started with you. It's your counterpart. Nine of Cups is a pregnancy announcement and engagement announcement. And this bastard is sitting right here spying. They're trying to figure out if this is coming. Bitch, it is. You fucking doofus. Yeah, bondage, mind control. And then we have can't trust them in the reverse. So somebody is trying to fuck with your mind to make you feel like you can't trust somebody, but you can. Or what they're trying to do is make you, they're trying, they're trying to make you trust them, but you know, you can't trust them. They're playing with your mind to stop you from, um, moving forward. What's the fuck is this Emperor Reverse? This is some sick shit here. Just period. Like it's real sick. Emotional abuse in the reverse chaos not interested in sex energy interference what's the emperor in the reverse tarot reader so you could be a tarot reader that healed from the emotional abuse you're not being emotionally abused anymore because you're strong enough to you know what i'm saying Fight that shit yeah second chances someone's getting a second chance so i feel like you can't be emotionally abused anymore night worker here yeah a bunch of hoes what's what's what else for this emperor in the reverse so this person is working with yeah more than one karmic in the reverse they losing their hoes okay this person here is going out scouting other people it look like they are too they're going out scouting other people lying to them about you and shit like that because they losing their hoes people finding out shit about their stupid ass they finding out shit about their clown ass scary ass bitch i can't stand this motherfucker <laughs> like I'm serious like I, y'all see me going there I ain't trying to go there but I'm saying what what else they losing their hoes <laughs> yeah porn addiction this person here they got a problem they got a real fucking problem or I, I don't know what, what's what's night worker switching up they're switching up on you in the reverse. What's night worker here with switching up on you? Injustice and toxic. <laughs> family, yeah, somebody in your family. What's this porn addiction? Feeling conflicted and confused. Somebody here could be on the down low. What's porn addiction with? Yeah, lower self. Yeah, somebody is just... Ooh, child. Walking away from a situation. Yeah, somebody is done with this shit. Or this could be your masculine walking away from somebody like this. But somebody got an issue. Like, real bad. What's this King of Wands reverse? Important message. What's King of Wands reverse? I don't want to be a player no more. Yeah, in the reverse. Betrayal, witnessing, infidelity. Yeah, somebody here catching this person cheating with a reckless ass. King of Wands in reverse is reckless sexually. This is an incubus masculine. What's the King of Wands reverse? Yeah, they can have Gemini in their chart. Or they bipolar as fuck. They can have Aries in their chart. Materialistic, yeah, divine feminine, love, spells, abused. Exactly, divine feminine. What's the King of Wands reverse? Married man in the reverse. So they are a married man. They in a relationship with us. I mean, I mean, so they're not a married man. <laughs> I'm tripping. What else? Family. Somebody in your family. So obviously, somebody you got family with. I feel like you got a child with this bitch. Sadly, yeah. Smudge, cleanse your phone space and yourself. Yeah, narcissist. It's a no for me. Give me one more. For revengeful forcing justice. <laughs> yeah, bitch. And that justice is going to be on your clown ass. This person is crazy. What's important message? Yeah, GPS tracking. What's important message here? Stalking, following, watching near. <laughs> What's the important message? 
standing in my power. Yeah, that's so important message because you're not playing with this stupid hoe. What's a family? Emotional labor, one-sided. What's family? She devil. I feel like the important message is these people around this mother, this this damn person is getting the like they seeing that this person is a fucking liar. Yeah, she devil, malicious or spiteful woman. <clears throat> I'm also getting, there's a masculine here that's dealing with like a best friend that slept with their ex and shit like that. Now the bitch pregnant and all that. Like that's so fucking weird. But let's see, what's she devil here? Black magic. Someone's doing black magic here. What's, what's she devil? So this person, this, okay, yeah, masquerade, games, GPS tracking. What's she devil here? Temperamental. <laughs> Okay, I feel like I'm talking about two different situations, but somebody has lost their mind. Real shit. Somebody here did all this just to get married for money or use somebody. It's a warlock here. It's a dark witch here. Keep going back and forth between divine feminine and divine masculine. <laughs> Everybody getting called out here. Everybody getting called out. <laughs> and I feel like good good because we tired we are truly tired of you bitches so this is your reading copy i hope that it resonated for you okay like comment subscribe turn your notification bell on press the all button so you won't miss my reads and i'll talk to y'all later bye